Hello and welcome back to the channel. Now in this lesson, we're going to learn about adding free curves and spirals to an alignment in Civil 3D. Let's get started. In this exercise, you'll add a free curve and a free spiral curve spiral to a simple alignment. The drawing contains a simple alignment, as you can see here, consisting of three tangents. In the next few steps, you'll add free curves at circles B and C. This exercise continues from the previous exercise where we created an alignment from the Alignment Layout Tools toolbar. Go ahead and open up the Align-2 drawing in your Tutorials folder. Now set your drawing window so that you can see both circles B and C on the surface. If the Alignment Layout Tools toolbar is not open, select the alignment, right click, and select Edit Alignment Geometry. In the toolbar, go ahead and select this drop down menu, and then select Free Curve Fillet between two entities using a radius. Now the command line is asking us to select the first entity. Go ahead and select the tangent that enters into circle B. Then select the tangent that exits from circle B. Press enter to select the default value of a curve less than 180 degrees. Now enter a radius value of 200. Now you can see the curve is drawn between the two tangents as specified. Go ahead and exit out of your command and zoom into circle C. Now select this drop down menu and select free spiral curve spiral between two entities. It's asking us for our first entity. Select the tangent that enters into circle C then pick the tangent that exits circle C. Go ahead and press enter to select the default value of a curve less than 180 degrees and then enter a radius value of 200. Enter a spiral in length of 50 and then enter a spiral out length of 50. Now note that notice the default values that are shown on the command line. As you can see right here, go ahead and exit the layout command by right clicking in the drawing area. Now go ahead and zoom out. And as you can see, this is how we go about adding free curves and spirals to an alignment in Civil 3D. If you'd like to learn more about Civil 3D workflow tips and tricks, visit AutoCADCivil3DTraining.com and be sure to sign up for future video notifications or click subscribe on our YouTube channel. Again, my name is Charles Ellison. Take care.